Hello guys, so I have this laptop, it's just the same laptop uh, from the previous video that I just cleaned. Uh, well, it still doesn't look very clean, but uh, it's pretty clean. So it actually came in for keyboard replacement and uh, luckily for this one, I managed to get a genuine one, brand new genuine one. So it should be a nice, quick, easy repair. It's a different layout, but uh, it's the US English layout. And here we have a UK English layout, but uh, that will have to do because uh, there were no other options for this particular ASUS model. So uh, let's begin. See how long it's gonna take. It should be much faster than to actually, than it took to clean it. So. Uh, just flip it over, make sure the bench is clean, so it wouldn't scratch the lid, so there we go. Mm, shouldn't be any hidden screws on this one, just uh, one missing screw, it's not a problem. Take a guitar pick, stick it in somewhere to the side, and oops, I missed one screw. Is. And there you go, so the keyboard with the trackpad and the whole palm rest comes just right off and nice and easy. Here's what's happening inside, very cheap laptop, the, the DVD-ROM is just a plastic dummy and uh, yeah small little fun quite dirty Just clean it up with compressed air. I'm not doing a full service, but still needs to to do a quick cleanup. So I hit the screws behind the screen and I still managed to lose a couple of them. So not a problem. We have more here ready. So Two screws for the fan. Well, I need one. So, there we go. 
quelqu'un. Ok. I'll put this one aside. And let's check what we need to transfer over to the new keyboard. So everything's there. It only seems to be missing the trackpad. And I might also put this black tape over to this one. Okay. Nice and easy, no surprises. Trackpad removed, and I'll try to nicely peel this protective sheet off. Because it's not on the new one, but uh, well, it will do no harm if I will transfer it. It usually should protect the motherboard from from touching the back of the keyboard just in case if you hit it too hard so yeah and the old one comes like that and here's the new one goes back in to make sure that cable looks kind of sideways so I just want to make sure it's properly connected and and I also want to check how to bend this cable something like this tape goes here cool back to the laptop and just need to connect both the keyboard and trackpad back so that's the keyboard that's the trackpad Everything clips in nicely. There you go, flip it over. Okay, so I lost some screws there behind my bench. So I need one, two, three, four, five, 
four long ones and three short ones. Too short. Okay. And the long screws seem to be pretty weird. I already found all the short ones and Okay, I need one more. That's it. All the screws back in, and there uh, we flip it over, and of course, ta da! Nice and new. So, what I'll do now, I'll just uh, probably change the keyboard layout in the system to the US keyboard, and it's to go so thanks for watching again and uh, see you next time